Mm. This isn't something you want happening in the middle of the build. This is hot glue. This is popped off here, whilst this one is, um, uh, whilst this one is uh, being taped up. Inside here is the crinkled paper. If I put pressure on here, it's going to crush the paper and crush the the, the thing. But I have to bridge that gap. That's that's uh. One, two, four, three and a half, four mil, millimeter gap. The only way I'm going to be able to do it is to put some uh, thread across from there to here and pull all the way across. It's going to be a pain in the neck to do. Um, I should get a push right the way round, right the way round onto here and here from pulling on that. Uh, which will push those outwards and get a pull on here. So it'll be bridging um, twine from there, right the way over to there. Mm. I can't pull it on the pipes because it'll twist the pipes, potentially start, uh, uh, it'll bend the pipes and start doing horrible things there to that. Likewise, this one has come off, which I didn't realize it was hidden underneath the tape. That's obviously pulled off at some point. That one's even more of a problem. I'm actually going to have to wait for this to completely dry, and uh, um, uh, yeah, for the resin to cure, um, or put some sort of um, uh, cloth cloth around it here and here, um, and, uh, and get a pull on that, a pull on that, on, on the um, twine to uh, to bridge over. But that's that's literally just popped and popped off us. About five millimeters, so it's got to be bridged there. This one's fine, that hasn't come off. So that's, that's all right. And the other one that I've noticed is that this one is glued on two millimeters with a two millimeter gap. Yeah, that's, a, that's annoying. It's actually a, I think a small gap in that I know what happened I didn't put any I didn't put any twine on this one as it was just it was drying so I'm gonna have to break that off and put it back on again but um, these are these are dried dried overnight they're not fully cured but they're dried overnight I'll put some tape on here to make sure that the pieces that were underneath didn't um, didn't ping off because you can see these these strands on the end were peeling forward I didn't want that like that one that one's peeled forward but it's at the bottom layer so it's kind of okay Oh good, good. Markings numbers on them, one, 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 one. And these ones have a two. That's the number of wraps that have been done on these. Yeah. But yeah, that's that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. That's those. And uh oh, that's progressing really well actually. The next nodes I wanted to wanted to do before I spotted those um the pipes. Kind of thing. The next nodes I wanted to do the uh, paper on were this one, this one, this one, this one, and this one, because then I could begin to do some of the actual tetrahedra. Um, but instead, what I'll probably have to do is these, and I have to begin packing paper around these ones as well whilst I'm waiting for the. Um, for the glue to set on 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 this on this one, the one that was popped off. Yeah. <laughs> it's not a bad um, it's not a setback. It's just kind of to be expected.